People like us that believe in physics know that the distinction between past, present, and future is only a stubbornly persistent illusion. With the coming of Einstein's general relativity, physicists were presented with a new headache. They knew that every particle in the universe had a past, present, and future. And like a line drawn on a map, they could chart the journey of a particle through the four dimensions of space and time, tracing out its individual world line from the past to the future through a series of nows. Each particle in your body, each electron and quark, journeys on its own world line. Before you were conceived, the world lines were dispersed. But as you grew, many world lines condensed into a bundle, which is you. And when you are gone, these world lines will again scatter. For a fleeting moment in the life of the universe, you exist as little more than a collection of world lines, a brief knot in the fabric of eternity. Firstly, we have to remember what the relativity of time really means. With no absolute time, there is no uniform cosmic clock. And this means that there is no such thing as a unique present, a true instant of now. 